$30,000 is what this car is worth. This is a Brazilian car that was manufactured by General Motors Chevrolet in Brazil. A yellow Chevrolet Opala from the 1970s. This car has versions with a V8 and also six cylinders. It is a beautiful and powerful car. Some people in Brazil have modified this car to reach over a thousand horsepower and be worth more than $300,000. It's absurd, isn't it? Unfortunately, this Opala we have here was abandoned for over 20 years and its condition is horrible. Stay in this video to see the true restoration we are going to do on it. The guy who brought the car here said he bought it for about $10,000, which is a fair price for a car like this. But in this condition, I still think it's a bit expensive. It was abandoned in a junkyard and was going to be dismantled. Luckily, the customer managed to buy it before that. I suspect this is the SS version. It doesn't have the front and rear emblems. It might have been stolen over the years. This car has around 200 horsepower in its original factory version, which is a lot for an old car like this, isn't it? I'm thinking of charging about $2,000 for the restoration we are going to do on this car. Besides the paint being horribly ugly and also very dirty, the interior of this car is no different. There are holes, several punctures, and broken parts in this car. The original paint of this car has been gone for a long time. It is down to the body and is all rusty with a crust of ingrained dirt. I don't know how we are going to restore this car and make it shine. Maybe we will even have to repaint it. If that's the case, we will have to charge an extra thousand dollars to the customer. Is it fair or not?
The customer said he asked the guy who sold him the car how it ended up there. He told us that the yellow Opala was like part of the family for the previous owner. But one day, that part of the family was taken from him. You know in the movie John Wick, when some criminals stole his Mustang? It was almost the same thing, except the guy wasn't any John Wick. He tried to get the car back from the criminals and ended up losing his life in the process. The criminals ended up having the car impounded and fled to avoid suspicion of the murder. The car stayed in the police yard for so long that they decided to get rid of it and left it in a junkyard.
And this was the result of our auction Opala. What did you think? This was the most difficult polishing we have ever done. Besides being one of the worst cleanings due to this car being all corroded inside, the customer thinks he will still get the value of $30,000 for this car. Do you think he can get that for a car in these conditions? He wants to export it to Europe. He says he will be able to sell this car for much more there because he says it is a rare model there. Do you think he can? Then subscribe to the channel and stay tuned for more projects.